Safe by Accident. In this video, author Dr. Aubrey Daniels wraps up a discussion about safety in the workplace, putting it all together, how understanding the science of human behavior will lead to a safer and more productive workplace. One of the things that, you know, obviously when you're using a scientifically based approach, you should be able to get measures and data, you know, hard data. And the, the data of safety is behavior. And so we need a way to see behavior. And one way to see behavior in the abstract is to develop a matrix, some sort of way that we can look at more than one behavior at a time. Now understand, looking at a, a graph doesn't show you behavior unless there's a 100% correlation between the number and the behavior. See, many lagging indicators like incident rate are not directly uh, related to behavior. Then abstraction, which loses the impact of the actual behavior. So we can, we can uh, use a matrix to track several behaviors that we're looking at to get to some what we call habit strength. And, and we can begin to reinforce uh, improvements in those, in those numbers. But we've got to make sure again that we don't reinforce the wrong thing I want to make sure that we understand this man's role to make sure that when they use consequences, you know, whether we use intangible consequences or social consequences or what, that they make sure that they're for the right behavior, either on the part of the employee or on the part of the manager. The best way to have a totally safe environment would be to bring everybody in and have them sit down all day. And we would have zero incidents zero recordables. Now, but the, but the fact of the matter is that that's not how we do safety in business. That, that safety is what we're supposed to produce a product or service in a safe way. So it, in my mind, it's very hard to separate production, quality, cost, and safety. You know, safety is the gate with which we do all of these other things. And we can't think about production without thinking about safety. We just can't do that. Because we know if we have a safety event, it's going to be a very costly thing. And it's going to disappoint not only the stockholders, but it's going to disappoint our customers and our employees. So what we have to do is we have to think about, why are we being safe? We're being safe to produce a widget at the lowest cost, uh, at the highest quality. And so we look at that in the beginning to say, here's what it takes to produce this widget at the lowest cost and the highest quality. So how can we do that safely? And let's make sure that that's the focus. It's not just being safe for being safe's sake. It's being safe in order to do something to accomplish something, and that should be the focus. Safe by accident, taking the luck out of safety. For more from Dr. Judy Agnew and Aubrey Daniels, and to purchase the book Safe by Accident, visit the website safebyaccident.com.